Hey everyone, it's Andrew Guyant with Simply Vegas, and I am out here in Henderson, Nevada with a home for sale behind me. It's a 1919 square foot home. It's two story, single family home. It's listed for 474.9, four bedroom, three bath, two car garage, has a nice little patio on it. And it's actually a little bit interesting. It's not technically a single family home. It's actually a town home. The garages are connected and that's all. I'll show you what I mean. It's pretty great. Let's go inside and take a look. I hope you like it. Follow me. Okay, everyone, here we are. We have this two-story 1919 square foot home. We are in an area, uh, this being a town home, all of this landscape is going to be taken care of for you. So you don't have to worry about any of this. You actually don't have to worry about anything outside of the home. And I'll show you what I mean. So on the right here, uh, this is a corner lot. So you're going to have more windows in this home. Uh, we'll see from the inside. This area right here is going to be your patio. Uh, and then you have a little bit of a side yard going down over here. We'll just take a quick look. So just a, just a little space, but not really anything you can do there. This is going to be your patio and I'll show you. So looks like a single family home. And it seems like a single family home, however. We walk through here and this is the home to the right here. We're going to see the garage. So this is the garage here. The only place this home is attached to another home or the garage walls are shared. Now that's great value because they're considered a town home where normally you're sharing an entire wall or maybe even two or three, sometimes more with your neighbors. You have a neighbor, you know, on either side, um, the way it's configured. So, it is great that this home is separated completely uh, other than the, the driveway there. And you do have a little area outside as well. So let's go inside and take a look. You do have this elevation with the rock as well. Um, we shouldn't have to worry about anything outside of the home necessarily. Uh, the HOA should take care of most of, of the outside for you. Nice bright red door coming in. Again, this home's only about a year old. So as you walk in here, so we have kind of the main living area right as we walk in. You can see uh, we have windows on both sides, which is unusual for a town hall uh, to have this many windows. We do have the TV area here, going to be the great room. The kitchen is immediately inside to the right. Nice big island. Has this black and white granite with the... Uh, red wine stains on it which i really like i think i had a previous video with that similar counter uh countertop so that's a dr horbin countertop you see a lot white uh, cabinets stainless steel appliances again about a year old on this one uh so a lot of this stuff is you know paul all of it's been installed recently so this is just a little outdoor patio area for you uh, a couple chairs a table I see some people putting tarps up. I don't know if you're allowed here, but maybe get you a little extra shade. But it looks like, I mean, it is, you know, morning right now, and you do have a bit of shade out there, so that is nice. But a nice big open kitchen. You can stand here, do your dishes, chop your vegetables, whatever you're doing on this side, and still watch TV and, and partake in, you know, the activities in the family room. Do you have a dining room in this area or a dining area if you did want to put a dining table over there? And this house does have a giant pantry, but for this size home, very big pantry, plenty of storage space. So that's actually one of the best features of this home so far is that huge pantry. Uh, so as we keep coming back, what about a 14 by 14 gray tile with a gray uh, grout between it? Laundry room downstairs, which is always great, doesn't shake the house when the spin cycle's going. Does come with a washer and dryer, refrigerator, dishwasher disposal. We do have one bedroom downstairs. So a nice window out the side of the house. So this window is on the one side of the house. The window I showed you before is on the other. We have front windows. So you actually have windows on three sides of this home, which is fantastic. Do you have a big closet under the stairs as well? So a nice big area here to store things. And it does curve around to the left there with the light. The downstairs bathroom, and uh, this one's going to be fiberglass tub, fiberglass shower combo. It's like the toilet needs a little repair, but toilet seat, nothing to be concerned about. They do have a few grab bars installed there, which is interesting. And that matching granite and cabinets. 
And then off to the left here, we have our closet, our uh, coat closet, I apologize. And then we come out to the garage. Now, sometimes people will still have things in their garage when the home is for sale. This is one of those instances, uh, but you can see a nice big uh, two-car garage. Uh, there is a tankless water heater there, which is fantastic as well. And a water softener loop right there. So it doesn't come with the water softener, but it does have the loop. Uh, so you can just add one pretty easily. That's it for downstairs. I'm going to take another look at this big main room here. All right, there we go. And then we'll go take a look upstairs. So yeah, for four seventy four nine, it is a really great value to get into this part of town for an almost 2,000 square foot home. That's basically a single family. You do have uh, the benefits of the town home. You're just missing the yard. I mean, outside of that, it's very similar to a single family home. I mean, it basically is just that attached garage. So as we come up the stairs, we go to the right. We're going to come into the primary bedroom here. Ceiling fan. Same granite countertops, two sinks, nice big, long uh, vanity here, the white cabinets. Do have the water closet with the door, which is great. Glass sliding uh, shower doors there. No tub in this home, only the shower, and that's a nice fiberglass enclosure. You can tell how new everything is. It's, it's very clean. Nice, big walk-in closet. Uh, very, very big space in here, and also you have the windows, which is great. And you have a strip view, so not many walk-in closets come with a strip view. Okay, yes, yeah, so I don't know if you can see that, but way out over these, right over here, that's the Las Vegas Strip. So right over Amazon there, you see the Las Vegas Strip. Okay, so now we're going to keep moving on. So yeah, nice uh, big primary closet. And, uh, you know, I was thinking if we had that view from the closet, we'd probably have a strip view from the bedroom. Lo and behold, there it is right there. Strip view from the bedroom. That's great. You can literally lay in your bed and see the Las Vegas lights at night. That's pretty amazing. Usually there's a huge upcharge for that. And for under 500, that's fantastic. So a lot of good values here already. Recessed lighting in the bedrooms. That's great. Don't have to worry about a lamp. You have plenty of light. It's about 12 by 12 room. Maybe 12 by 11. Really nice big wide closet. Uh, standard size, uh, this is a third bedroom we're seeing, second bedroom upstairs. And again, windows on every side of the house upstairs. This is going to be the last bedroom, the fourth bedroom, third bedroom upstairs. So uh, about the same size as the one next door here. It's almost an exact opposite. Uh, same big closet, same window, about 12 by 11. So recessed lighting in the ceiling. We do have a living closet here also uh, next to these bedrooms and the bathroom there. Nice big linen closet and the upstairs shared guest bath. Um, not guest bath, but shared full bath for the uh, two bedrooms upstairs to share. So a nice fiberglass tub, very clean again. That same tile we see on all the wet areas. Uh, nice vanity here. Matching granite, uh, white cabinets, everything matching throughout the home. So that's the upstairs, no loft, but 1,919 square foot. My name's Andrew Guy. Thank you so much for watching. Uh, if you have any real estate questions, needs, you know anyone that has any real estate questions or needs, please give me a call right away. I would love to help you out. Thanks for watching. Andrew Guy with Simply Vegas. I will see you on the next tour.